process of filing bills. Yes. Because that's another thing that's, do you come up with a bill? Do you co-sponsor a bill? How does that work? Okay. So the way that works is I get ideas from constituents as well, okay. right? Um, or what's going on in the world today yep. or, or things. And you have a bill filing time limit. So okay. it starts at each session is two years. So at the beginning of those two years, you have bill filing, okay. which is not a long time. We have like maybe a week or two. So you're working on those bills oh. all year. You're always thinking of new bills or talking to constituents, their concerns. And they all get filed at once within that two weeks? They all get filed at once. Oh, and okay. there's about 7,000 bills filed each session. So in the House or in, the Senate? In the or House both? and the Senate. Okay. Right? Wow. So what is really important, and I stress this to my constituents, if there's something that's important to you, yeah. there's a bill that you know of that's really important to you, please reach out to me or reach out to your state representative and your state senator to let them know, I'm really interested in this bill. I'm either in favor or I'm really opposed okay. because I may not know that bill. Mm -hmm. And if it's important to you, I want it to be important to me right. so I can flag it and watch it for you. Right. Um, I can let you know when the hearing is. So that's another thing. So the bills, we go through the bill signing period and then we go through co-sponsorship. Okay. So our colleagues will contact you and say, look at this Look at this bill, please. Yep. If you're in support of it, will you please co-sponsor it? So the more co-sponsors on the bill, the better the chance the bill has? Uh, not necessarily, but it, it, it shows that you have more support. Sometimes okay. it helps, okay. um, but not necessarily. But you do like to get a lot of co-sponsors, so that makes more people aware of the bill. Okay. So more of your colleagues are now aware of that bill, okay. and they're talking about it, right? Okay. So that's which is important, great. which is great. great. Uh, and then it's assigned to a committee. Okay. And once it's assigned to a committee then you have a hearing, a public hearing on it, where people will come in and they'll, we call it testify. Yep. So they'll sit in front of the committee mm -hmm. and they'll give their testimony, whether they're in favor or opposed yep. and why. Yep. And they have three minutes to do that. Yep. But what is great this time is where we did have the pandemic, we took the Zoom component. Yeah. So now you can don't have to come to the state house. Right. You can do it virtually, or you can write a letter yep. and and bring it in. Right. So it's, it opens it up for more people. More people right? can get involved more in that can, process can of have of, a voice of, of right? making a bill. Yes. So if a bill is brought in front of the committee and it's gone through hearings and it's decided upon, yes, we does that then become a law? No. Okay. No, it's a long process. Okay. So we'll listen to all the testimony and then we as a committee will vote on the bill. Okay. So we'll vote whether to move it forward, um, to really squash, squash it, it yep. it's not yep. or to study. So study doesn't mean well study means it's not gonna pass that session, but we're gonna look into it a little more. It might need a little more uh, research yep. on that yep. or, or talk to more little, people. Yeah. Uh, and it will come back next session. Okay. So then from there, it will either go to Ways and Means or it will go to third reading. Okay. And then that's another process before then they all go to third reading before they go to the floor. Okay. And the floor votes and whether or vote. not to actually yes. make it a, mm -hmm. a law or not. Yes. Okay. Correct. But it does have to pass the Senate as well. Right. For it to become a law. And then the right. governor has to ultimately sign it. Okay. So it's a so long it has process. To go through the, so it doesn't matter where a bill starts. It can start in the House. Correct. Or it can start in the Senate. Yes. But it all ends up having to be kind of a, a joint Everybody Both, has to, everybody has has to, to agree. Okay. And then okay. the governor will sign it into law. Okay, so that's a bill. 